We're here with Kara and Sophie from Costera Interiors. Ladies, welcome. Why don't you say a little bit about yourselves and the origins of the business? Hi, thanks for having us. Yes, we are Costera Interiors. I'm Kara. This is Sophie. We are the owners of Costera Interiors, and we are a home staging business and interior design business here in Santa Barbara. And a little bit about what we do. We are half uh, home stagers, so we get listings ready to go live on the market. We fully furnish them uh, to look beautiful uh, for listing photos and for open houses. And then the other half of our business is interior design, and we do full-scale renovations, kitchen remodels, entire home remodels, furnishing. Costera came about three years ago uh, in the height of COVID, <laughs> actually. Yeah, when uh, real estate actually really started to boom here um, in Santa Barbara. Sophie and I both left former careers and joined together. We were friends first, and we both had a passion for interior design, loved it, did a little bit uh, ourselves on the side. And then COVID happened, and we found that there was really a spot for us in the market here to start home staging. And we kind of just dove head first. <laughs> yeah, we got a box truck, filled it with furniture, and within a week staged our first property, and we, we never looked back. March is Women's History Month, and along with that, we're spotlighting a few women-owned businesses that we work with regularly. You're our first, so tell us a little bit about what it's like to be a woman in today's world, in Santa Barbara, and in this profession. Yeah, well, thank you. I feel, we feel honored to be included in this spotlight, and it's super important to us to be kind of a female-owned, female-powered business here in Santa Barbara. We hire female staff. We have two gals on our team and yeah, it feels really empowering. And, you know, it was really important to Kara and I as female business owners to kind of be our own boss per se. And, um, and we feel very empowered and, you know, proud of ourselves for doing that. And especially being both being uh, working moms, which is a whole other layer to the female owned business. We are at 201 Cannon Drive, our new listing in San Roque. And these ladies are going to take us inside, look through what they did here, and sort of give you the background on, on how they uh, designed the concept. This house, for example, one of the first steps in our process when we're coming for the consultation is we'll check out the architecture and the overall layout of the home. The first thing we noticed when we walked into this property is that it is an open floor plan living room, uh, dining room concept. So this is hard sometimes for buyers to imagine how they are going to furnish uh, three spaces in one. This is actually dining, entryway, and living room in one space. So, you know, the first thing we do is talk about our layout and um, making sure you don't block views of the fireplace, making sure there's enough seating, you know, six person dining is ideal. Um, and then we love an entryway moment. It's like the first thing people see when they walk into a property and we love making that beautiful with a mirror, coffee table books, good accessories. The moment that we really strive for in a home when we're staging it is for it to not feel too staged. Uh, we want it to feel, have an element of feeling lived in. So we feel like coffee table books, knickknacks, textiles, whether it's in accent pillows, rugs, throws over a chair, you know, those kind of layered elements that give it a little more life and character and make it feel more lived in per se. But that feels really important to us when we're finally going in and styling the home and throwing all the, you know, final pieces together. 